the club was opening the first uh, trio I joined and then the next season I became the captain. We got a, a really good team. Today we are really good friends. Uh, we won the seasons on the local league and we were going to Daytona by that time. During the training, I had some issues and I went to the doctor and I found out that I have um, breast cancer. Breast cancer with a metastasis to the lymph nodes. I decided to stay going to Daytona with the girls. I didn't play because I had surgeries and stuff. We got to the finals and right away we started. I call it my adventure. It's like um, my chemo. My first chemo was really strong for two months. And what it killed me, kept me uh, uh, happy about every time I go, I went to chemo is knowing that I have a room with all the girls in the room with my chemo, with breakfast and lunch, and they made my day really special, really special. My teammates from Israel, from Canada, from Colombia. With the fun, loving sports that changes really a lot of things in my life, in my perspective, and I think we're just having a lot of fun. We have a great leader here. She's an example, I think, for many girls and many uh, women. And she always brings the girls together and encourages us to get along and, and just be happy to be out here playing tennis, which is the most important thing, that we have our health and that we have our friendships. I just can't explain and say enough of um, how lucky I am that I finally got with all these girls together. It's been just so much fun and uh, I have learned so much about not only tennis but life in general and friendship and, um, and that's what keeps us together.